Hey guys, welcome back to another session of Dawn of Man. So right now we are in beautiful fall and everything looks awesome. I don't remember the last time I played. I think the last time was maybe last week. Wednesday, don't know how that happened. The weekend just slipped by me. But yeah, so we're up to 35 people now here in paradise and half of our huts have been turned into straw huts which means we've done really well on the upgraded housing so might as well do the rest of them right can't let these last four people live like that i'm pretty sure that before i ended the last episode i sent people out to do some harvesting of the grains and straw those kinds of plants, but I decided to keep going with that because it doesn't seem like we have a lot going here. I mean, we are in the process of doing that, but it's almost the end of fall and, you know, we barely have anything over here. We do have some straw though. That's good. But n probably not nearly enough to rebuild these tents. We've already unlocked goat domestication. I think we should actually try to find a goat, whatever that may be. Whatever that's called out here. So I couldn't find a single goat. I What was I even looking for? I was looking for, yeah, goat. I couldn't find a single goat. Not even one. I found things that could turn into sheep. I don't know, but now it's the very beginning of winter. I did send out some people to go hunt a bear, but it's kind of far off, so it'll be a while until they get there. I hope no one, you know, gets hurt. It's one of those young ones that were out on their own, so I figured. I saw a woolly mammoth, and I think you're supposed to hunt them before they go extinct. I'm not entirely sure though. But if if I don't, I think what would happen, yeah, I'm not entirely sure, but I think if I don't hunt them, they'll just, I won't be able to hunt them later on. But that's all. So we have three more tents to upgrade. Right now we can fit 45 people. I don't see the harm in that. Are we good on all of our sub? Wow, deer. That was the first time we ever hunted deer. And we got a new, another little girl. That's awesome, we're up to 36 people now. But yeah, but yeah, since my point was, since woolly mammoths are so dangerous, I'm afraid of losing people in the process, but it is something we could do to unlock some knowledge points. I did say that I wanted to start on structures. So on our defense, since actually maybe another watchtower would be nice, like somewhere off here. First, the watchtower, then maybe like a gate around it. I never can decide what's like a good place. Yeah, so we did get that bear. They they got it without getting hurt. Proud of you. It was a young one, all by itself. Oh, when he died, it sounded like he died from being attacked or something. He just died of old age. Uh, sixty-six. That's old, I guess. Four new people. So we've reached 40. That's cool. I, I don't know. What what did you guys, like, get a flyer? See an opening? Oh, not 40 because the person died. So it kind of, like, counted it. Oh, and then a human was born just to make it 40 again. That was, yeah, because that was kind of a cheat. Because getting to 40 is what got us all those points in the first place. I saw a lot of sheep. I saw sheep way more than I did goat. And I do want to finally try to domesticate some animals. And I do want to build a wall. I'm avoiding this because I 
don't know how this is going to look. And it sucks. And can we not? Can we not down trees during the winter? Like, why aren't they down in trees? I thought I set up a work area. Or is it depleted? Maybe it, Maybe it's depleted? I'm not sure. I don't want to down any useful trees, though, but we do need to cut down a few around here. Now I'm kind of confused on how I would do this properly. All right, let's just try, like, a... Uh, like a nice straight path like that first and can we just put a gate in wherever because they would they would need a gate here hmm I'll wait till the wall's built before I try to add a gate all right, trader. Oh, you're cold. Do I not have enough clothes? Of course not. No. Of course not. And I'm going to get skin outfit, but we don't have any. This crafter. He's on the way to make clothes. Let's see if I can move all of these. Every time every single time i have to remember we have plenty of skins just because we we don't need to kill animals to help repair stuff anymore but every single time somebody comes in okay trader <laughs> yeah this is the first time from using the trader that i actually felt really good about what i traded we got some, I, we got clothes, we got wool, we got linen outfits. This is awesome. I don't even know when that happened. When did we, it wasn't because we bought the wool, because we don't have any sheep to shear. And I want us to go find some sheep. Fact. Let's see. Snaps. Is that that's not something they would go out and get on their own, right? It wasn't like the dogs. I felt like the dogs they just went out and got on their own. Because that sure didn't tame all of them. We have eight. Like that seems like a lot. Oh, you know what? <sighs> Ooh, in the meanwhile though, we do need another sled. We have 40 people. I think only five sleds. It's a good idea to build another one, even though it takes skins. And I hate using skins, but we need it. So let's go into primal vision mode. That's my weakness, remembering to get into that mode. We're almost done with winter. Yeah, look at that. It's coming from all the way over there, hauling a sled. I found a few little babies that I could take away from their families. So that will be awesome. We'll get some little sheep right over there don't look like sheep though guess we'll see actually can we follow the people that are going to do this all right well she's hungry but she's going to go do it like a trooper Uh, we gotta turn around. I want to see this happen. So, you know. Oh, 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 oh. Oh. Look at that. Come on, little boy. Come with me. Or girl, I don't know. Come with me. Aww. <laughs> nice. <laughs> oh, that's cool. Oh. Uh, what did you do? Where did you get all that skin from? Oh, that's adorable. All right, let's get out of this mode.
Oh, can't wait to get you little piggies too. You're sad. Is it because your friend died? Not enough stable space for animals. I guess we need to build stables. Well, yeah, it's like you got a new pet. Where do you put it? No clue. Uh, okay, so I thought you were just gonna hang around, but clearly not. Uh, is that something we can build now? Oh, on the residences. State, whoa. Whoa, that's big. That is, that is not a little stable. Hmm. I guess we'll have to keep it over here. We don't have too much room anywhere else. Oh, well, we could keep it there. Huh. Okay, I'm, I'm wasting time trying to pick a location. So we need mud, which we don't have enough of. Straw, sticks, two logs. Do we even have enough logs? And, mm, yeah, we do. Mm, make that a priority. We need space. I didn't think about it. It's like taking on my hamster and not bothering to get the cage. Uh, and we survived the winter again. That has never really been a problem. Maybe I'll eat my words and hardcore mode, but right now, not really a challenge surviving the winter. Surviving those cows, though, that's a challenge. Wow, look how great everything looks. There's only two more houses. I think she's repairing that one, but it's like, don't bother, just upgrade it. Okay, I get you. I know the problem is being rectified at this moment. I'm an idiot. Should have thought about that ahead of time. <laughs> uh, for the storage, our storage huts aren't full, but it would be nice to upgrade these two, our little storage tents right here. And I think in doing so, they won't take up so much uh, they won't take up any skins as well because they need to be repaired. Yeah, I gotta, I gotta wait till that stable's done though. That's more important. Get it going. And we are in springtime. I think I said that already. And somebody just died of starvation. How? 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 Actually, our food is going down a little bit. How did you die of starvation? I don't understand. I know, I know, we need it. We're getting the stable done. How do you die of starvation? I'm, I don't understand. I can't even comprehend that. When we have food. Overworked, maybe, and didn't bother stopping to eat. I don't even know where he is. I'm just, I'm upset, though. Really upset about that. Okay, so we should start hunting again, though, because we don't have a lot of meat. And it's actually going down pretty fast. And there's a storm, just to make everything in our world a little bit brighter. So, guys, we can make it through. So how many animals do we have now? We do have all three goats that I sent them after. Wait, goats? They're goats? I thought they were sheep. I could have sworn because I had trouble getting goat. I swear that's what it was, 82 welfare. It looks like it's dropping too. Yeah, probably because of the storm. Our prestige is 173 though. Pretty good. We got a lot of females now and three of them are pregnant. We got a lot of elderly people though, overall. <laughs> so cute i could have sworn it says sheep though i am so confused and i was wondering how how does that look anything like a sheep now we can capture these young mouth fawn. so cute i mean that sound was not cute that sounded like death <laughs> our meat supply was getting a little concerning 
think it was down to 30. Like that hasn't happened in forever. You know, I was just saying, oh yeah, we don't need to hunt all the time anymore because I mean, I guess we still don't. We could, we could definitely survive off of fish and berries. Um, I don't know how ideal that would be, but it would be interesting to find out. I was thinking maybe we should do some sort of vegetarian-esque challenge. Oh, it's summertime! Wait, let me look at the task right now before I go crazy. Can you see the smile? Alright, 45% workload and... Oh, they, I think they just got done capturing the animals too. I don't even care. We don't need you anymore. At least not for now. It's berry season. Okay, so eventually I just have to stop. I think I went further than I ever did before. That message is going to be screaming at me all summer long. I definitely went a little bit overboard. And I can prove it to you. 372%. That's pretty ridiculous. In fact, there's like, there's a little bar. But, I mean, I found some cool things. Like, look at that. Lentils and bitter vetch and chickpeas. Like, those things grow out much further than our nearby surroundings. Yeah, they're, they're making quick work of it. I think, I think it'll be fine. I, I hope it'll be fine. I should say. I, also, I found, I think, one or two animals on the way. We'll see what extreme overwork does to society. I've never went this far before. Normally I'm around 200%, you know. But this, this is on a whole nother level. So I'll, I'll get to see. I mean, there's literally nothing I could do right now other than just watch as they hopefully... Animal population reached 15. Oh, between the dogs and the other things that I asked them to tame. Let's check that out. So we have four goat, two sheep, and nine dogs. Yeah, I'm also thinking that they do some hunting on their own, like without any um, requests to, because I do see like sometimes there'll be meat our skins on the ground far away or somewhere where I definitely didn't tell them to go. Well, in the meanwhile, ooh, no building, can't. Oh wait, we have more, we have eight, no, when did that happen? I feel like it happens so fast sometimes I never really notice. What do we want to do next? Stilting, well digging or underground mining. Hmm. Yeah, but people are not happy all the time. So maybe we need some good old fashioned spirituality, which means they're gonna be hauling these huge structures. I don't even know where I'm gonna put it. I kind of like our cozy little community, but that's not gonna be a thing anymore. Our capacity is up to 44 with all the huts. With all the huts, that's gonna get annoying. With all the huts updated. So it does mean that we do have to make more huts. Seems like, wait, oh, that one is actually still going. Never mind. False alarm. Raider attack. Ah. Whoa. Whoa, they're not even anywhere near. Oh no, one of my guys are dying. Ah. Two people killed. Wait. I don't know if they're still attacking. Ah, uh, old woman. Oh, 46. While they were doing the berries and an old man. All right. They have to still be around, though. I still hear this weird music. Everybody's coming from far, too. Where's the raiders? I'm confused. There. There they are. 
Are they killing another person? Oh! There is a lot of them! No! No! This is such a big attack! And it's not even in town where people can defend themselves! Oh my god! Wow! Look at all of these people! And they're still attacking! Okay, it's over. Okay. That's... Wow. Three people. <sighs> well, this is a sad day. Wow. Raider. One, two, three, four. That's one of our people. Five. Five raiders. All at once. Wow. A group of women raiders, too. They all came in. I got a new human. A new little boy. Such a sad day. 280. They can manage that. Summer's almost over, though. Oh, this raider attack. This raider attack interrupted all that berry um, collecting. Hate you guys. We when we do build spiritual stone circle, then you would need six of them. And where would we... ah? It's Stonehenge. Oh, okay. Yeah, we can make that just. That can be just outside of town, right? So this area is going to be our new stone circle, basically our Stonehenge, and we have to find six of these mighty rocks in order to co to create that. People are really tired now, but all these tasks, oh, I hate, the raiders interrupted all of that. Thanks guys, summer's almost over, not happy. I mean, it could, maybe they couldn't have done it from the get. I don't know. I just felt like they just came in and, and they killed us. They, they killed us, literally. Sucks. It just sucks. And they can't really do anything because uh, there's, there's still too many pending tasks. And I really don't want to delete any. Uh, but everything looks great so far, though. I can't really complain about that. I wonder why you can't upgrade the crafter. There's nothing being crafted, by the way. Like, we don't need anything crafted? Is that why? I guess not. 20 bows. One bow for every family, at least. We order. We got some stick knowledge. Alright, so we need to go hunting again, though. I want to hunt, I don't know if this is a smart idea considering how this episode is going. I do want to hunt some bigger prey, before they leave as well. I sent some people uh, to go after the woolly mammoth. And uh, hopefully that doesn't turn out terribly. I'm glad that... They're all going together. All right, let's watch. I'm so nervous. <laughs> uh, I'm nervous, but we won't get this knowledge or the skill if we don't try. I think I sent five people, but I'm only seeing four here. One person might be coming from a little bit further. They all got bows. Oh, one person's not early. Yeah, there he is. Guys, be careful. <gasps> oh, yeah, he's getting hurt. Whoa! They all survived? Let me escape this mode. Can't do anything in that mode. Yeah. 
I think everybody survived. Wow. Mm, that was not that was not terrible, but it wasn't worth it either. But I, I had to try. At least we got a little bit of victory. So it's the middle of winter now. I had to... I had to stop recording for a little... Well, I didn't stop recording. I just edited out the blank space. But yeah, so it's the middle of winter. I had to set aside some time to charge my headphones because they were dead. <laughs> and now we're back into it. So not much has changed. I added the little gate opening and I also started them on the megalith structure so that they can make the stone circle. So pretty much you're preparing this. After you mine it, you basically have to prepare it for transport and that's what they're doing now. And then I guess they'll pull it over to these circles. So it takes six to make that. Um, and they're all over the place. Hold on. Yeah. Oh, yeah. And we had... Well, this is our second newborn. So, yeah. Now we're up to 41 people. Also, the trader came into town and I bought a bunch of wool so that we can start having wool outfits. We can make that switch. We don't need to have so many skins. Although we do have enough skins. We have enough skins for everybody for the first time like ever no one new has come in this winter just people being born which is really really great i haven't checked on our prestige in a while though 97 percent 100 all right 97 percent welfare and 180 in prestige not too shabby 10 elders we have a lot of children but that's great a nice fresh young community I think some people are about to freeze to death though even though we do have not only enough skins but we have wool outfits we have six imagine 61 outfits just for cold weather and 50 for warm so yeah that's cool yep so nobody should be freezing if you're cold go inside that's why we got these nice upgraded huts Oh, and I also made a new watchtower. I didn't even see them put that up. They, they put that up really fast. Also, because I had that little bit of quiet time, I had the game speed on one. I was able to like actually think about these work areas. And I realized I could have placed a lot more. So I placed a lot more work areas around, um, mostly for harvesting and a few for hunting because in... This area down by the river, there's always a ton it's during the spring and summertime. There's always a ton of animals over there drinking water. Why isn't that a hunting area? It just might as well just be a hunting ground. Ah, we got... Whoa, when, when did 10 points happen? That just like... That took me by surprise. I didn't even see that. And now I'm like, I'm, I'm stuck again because there's... Even though it's only five options left, there's still just like, it's like I want it all at once right now, but we can't do that. All right, we'll do the well. I mean, I think I said something about getting a well an impossible amount of time ago, and I just haven't, no clue why. If you're cold, please go inside. I don't want anybody dying from freezing. I think it's ridiculous when you have enough resources for people to, die from things like that we have milk now that's cool and yeah i remember them saying something about during the winter you have to shelter and feed the animals so that's why there were none during i believe i could be wrong later on we'll see during spring and summer there wasn't any or fall in the stables but now they're stabled yeah, I think those megaliths that I asked everybody to mine are all done. They're ready. They're ready to be hauled off. Wow, that one is being prepped to be hauled off, actually. We just need the skins for it. I also, um, when I traded with the trader, I, I kind of gave away 
a lot of the skins. Hmm. So we can continue this wall probably this way. I wonder if you can build it across the river. That would be cool. Because then I would have the village maybe on either side of the river and then the gate goes all the way around. Because I know you can get a pretty sizable population. So maybe we would take some of the river territory as well. I don't know if it would work. Kind of sounds dumb now I'm saying it out loud, but you never know. I mean, if you have a gate along here and here, I guess they would have to swim in. But we'd have towers there as well. And, you know, all the weapons and protection you would need, I guess. We'll see. We'd have to make sure we had a decent amount of gates, too. That's so cool. That's, that's. <laughs> oh. That's pretty cool. We're just shearing the sheep. I wonder if you can build a part of the gate over this way without the boardscape. I don't even remember. It was probably a work area I set up, so we're going to get more of those messages. I never looked at their health points before, really. I didn't know that it was like... Look, as an adult, you have 200, and I guess elders get 150? Do women get different? Wow, 135 as a woman, old woman. What about like kids? The kids get 100. Little boy get 100. And little girls get 90 points. So yeah, there's a little health point distribution. Um, women are easier to, to get injured, I guess, to die. Oh, no. Yeah, if they get attacked. If they get attacked, women are easier to kill. Uh, so far, I think, though, more men have gotten killed in my playthrough. Two new humans. Three new humans. Four new humans. Four. Ah, 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 ah. And the traitor. <laughs> Wait, what are you doing? Going to get a wool outfit. It's well, it's, mm, it's 58 degrees, so fair enough. I was like, it's summer, not really. There's spells. I don't know. I don't think we've ever run out of those sheep. They're actually not that hard to get on our own, so I wouldn't trade sheep. I mean, it's not like we could trade any sheep of our own, but I oh, wouldn't bother. Uh, actually, I should see what we have first before I go and make some dumb decisions linen i don't know why it's it's hard to find flax so might as well hmm it's so crazy how much more i can trade now back and forth right before it used to be a struggle find anything now i'm like ah just have all this there you go have at it no problem well mainly because it's skin um okay i'm fine with that yes um trading yeah i mean what you have available in your trade is never going to really deplete you. It, at least it's not supposed to, I think, so far. Oh, look at all of those. Let's, can we make that a hunting work area? Mm. I don't know if that's a common, it looks like it is. Yeah, it's pretty close to the river where I set them up anyway. Um, But yeah, we need to actually go hunting because we, are low. We are low on meat. Yes, we are. Kind of low. We already hit seven knowledge points. Things are happening way too fast. 
And maybe it's because part of the reason is because I've been playing for a while. Um, so it's between these two. Because to move forward seems silly when we haven't even covered the basics. Stilting or underground mining, which we need to do a flint mine, copper mine. Uh, I don't completely understand what it gets us, but I'll go for it. I'll bite. So now, okay. Oh. We gotta check up on it every time we get that message. Yeah. It's escaped injured. We're not letting that happen. We're not letting it go. Guys, you should know better. We don't let go the injured. <laughs> okay, so we set up three flint mines, including one right next to home. So that is very convenient. Now we can extract even deeper into these little uh, mountain areas, hill areas, and get more flint from that, which will increase our weapons and our tools and all sorts of good stuff. Only benefits, no downsides. I can't wait to see that circle. I know it's a ton of work though. Anyways, the wall, we're back on that little issue. Hmm. So that's spiritual. Wait a minute, we could have created did I just skip? Holy crap. I just skipped and went straight for the stone circle. I don't recall all of these. Okay, so um, we'll play backwards catch up afterwards. I, I can't believe it. Did I? I don't even know how that happened. Um, but defense. We need to try to finish this wall here. And nope, you can't go over water. Mm. Oh well. Oh, that one's going to be cut down. Cool. So then we'll come over here and do it on the other side. Maybe we'll add more towers. So that the only way they can come is like, if they're coming across the river, it's like tower, tower, tower you're going down before you get here. And then, I mean, uh, unfortunately the attack previously happened when people were out. So there was really nothing we could do there, but yeah, we'll, we'll try. Uh, I, wanna, I wanna make sure we have a gate on this side. I don't want everybody to so yeah, cancel that. I forget how, I think the gate is three wide, so we cancel those. Yeah, make sure we have a gate over here as well. And then we can build it over here, and bam, stop there. So our area will be well protected. It's just when things happen on the outside, that's when, yeah, that's when we can't really control it. And that's how things generally are anyway. I'm not gonna build up the garden until I know what I'm doing on this side. This side might be where we have the garden. More of the uh, more of the farming stuff. Yeah, because I still wanna go ahead with the idea of having it like extend this way. It'll just be, there'll just be a gap, which isn't really that big of a deal. You know, we live on the riverside. I mean, it would be silly to like, cage ourselves in from the river. So she All right, so they're at the rolling megalith structure. They're setting it all up. Oh, nice. Yeah, setting up work areas something something that should have been done way way sooner i mean i set up work areas for all sorts of things and still like didn't acknowledge i don't know if i had the ability to do all the work areas at once but yeah they yeah, standing inside the rock cool though and then unfortunately they're gonna have to be doing a lot of dragging 
says it says we have six. Oh, new human. A new little girl. Nice. You know what? We have 40 wool outfits and 12 linen. Oh. Let me escape this mode. Alright, so yeah, we have 40 new outfits. I mean wool outfits, not new wool. Wow, 40. But we still have 45 skin outfits. It's crazy when you think about it. And another person died of old age. I wish it would give a more direct like marker of where they are. I'm Yeah, but we're still we're still pretty up. We have 44 people. Wait a minute, it is the middle of summer and did I set that up? Yeah, I did. I did set that up as a berry picking area. I am going to ease off of that, but I do want, I do want to create more work areas. They'll do it more naturally and more gradually and not go all berry crazy anymore. Can't believe I'm saying it. I'm not going to go all very crazy anymore. You heard me say it here first. I'm letting them collect the berries and stuff on their own. They're going to manage themselves now. Like, I'm going to be doing less micromanaging. Um, now that I have all the work areas set up, I believe that they can handle it on their, self, on their, on their own can handle it themselves. They're growing up. I feel like this kind of game is kind of like The Sims where if you um, if you set the village up or if you set up everybody in your household well enough, they'll be able to manage themselves without too much intervention. By the way, I just realized we're at 44. We were at 45 before and I'm not building any more houses. And why is that? I need to make another residence. So let's get another hut in the mix. Yeah, all that all that stuff. I'll probably put more of the greenery and stuff like that over there. So let's just put another hut right here. There we go. Okay, so yeah, I went and checked out if there were any woolly mammoths, and there are, but there's a whole family of them, like mom, dad two little kids uncle like i i can't mess with that they're just gonna slaughter us i mean yeah maybe we'd get one of the kids because they're not doing too well but then at the same time i could lose two or three people i don't think that's worth it we'll see though because i want to see what we can do to improve our knowledge points i mean we're moving pretty fast though i mean one good raider attack though and <laughs> And then we're screwed again, but we're we're doing pretty well. So apparently, um, I need to make more sleds because one of ours was destroyed. Uh, no longer usable. They do go bad after all. So, in fact, I think we should build maybe two, three, four. We have the skins. What else do you need from skins and sticks? We have the skins. And we certainly have the sticks, so there's no real reason we need to hold back. There we go. And we are back at another seven. So voila, all the basics are taken care of. Let's see what we can do with what we got now. Stilting. Stilting, stilting. I mean, there's still so much to do though. Um, but let's see what that builds. And the transport, so we can do a bridge to help easily cross this river. Wait, but it's too late. I'm I'm so dumb. I'm like, did it, did it go? Yeah. So. Let's set that to a priority. 
So we're going to build a bridge across here. It's going to be too late for these people, so they're just going to have to... Oh no, they're leaving it. Sweet. Okay. I don't know if they were going to do it or not. I don't know how they were going to do it. This guy's... Wow. So these three people just left this guy alone to continue. Well, he left as well there. He's like, you know what? Why, why am I breaking my back all by myself? Maybe in the time that it takes somebody to come back, they'll build this bridge. That's wishful thinking, right? Do we have enough wood? No, we don't. We don't have enough logs. We don't have any logs. Whoa. Whoa. All right. Yeah, I'm just making sure I'm not gonna... Didn't I set up... Didn't I already set up this area for tree cutting? Probably already did. Just cut down these right over here. You know, and I was saying, oh yeah, I'll keep these trees here because they'll look good next to these totems and then I'm just destroying them. I don't have to cut off the trees down right next to us either. I can always just do the ones outside as well. Contracted a disease? Is it heart disease? What disease? Whoa! Alright, so I haven't really... I haven't really checked out the new outfits. So that must be the linen outfit. But yeah, he's contracted the disease. Probably something that's just uncurable and a part of life and i mean disease is different from infection like the infection implied that she was going to get better but i don't know about this disease he's an old man 56 the oldest i think i saw you know when i went to check was 70. but we'll see maybe he'll stick around for a little longer we have 47 people and we can house 54. So we're actually a little close because normally they're coming in three, four. I don't think any, I don't think we've ever gotten five, but they, they come in in a big amount. So we should build another little hut. Good luck. The bridge is in production. This is what I have been waiting for. Yes. I mean, I think they already took the megalith thing. I don't even know how honestly they would get it past these structures. Yeah, it's already here. Awesome. So we have two out of the six. There's our little bridge. That looks very secure. I am proud <laughs> to say that looks very secure. It is just the beginning of winter and I have been playing for way too long. So I'm going to cut it off right now before I keep going the entire night. So I hope you guys enjoyed this playthrough of Dawn of Man. Hit the like button if you like this kind of content and if you want to see more. And I'll catch you next time. I enjoy so much playing this. So who knows when I'm going to stop. See ya. Thank you.